Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Yari Views back with another video and today I will show you guys 10 awesome iPhone apps that I believe every iPhone user must have on their device in February 2022. Usually we do these videos at the beginning of the month showing 10 cool new apps that you must have on your device and we have 10 for February here and we're starting things off with Charger X. Now Charger X is a pretty simple app, very simple to use, a very simple interface. What it does, it allows you to set here an alarm for your charging. So when you want your iPhone to charge, you can leave the alarm, let's say at 80% here, enable the alarm. And once your iPhone is charged up to 80%, it will sound the alarm so you know to plug out your iPhone. Now what you also get here are the battery info. You can see the current charge level. You can see the capacity of your device's battery right there. And then you will have here the media playback gaming call audio browsing and all that with this battery and with the battery level that you have on your iphone it shows you how much of them you can do next up is a safari extension called fire links now this is one of my favorite from this list because every time you want to share like a link from safari anywhere you want to share it on your social media maybe send it on a dm or something like that you will usually have a really long link that you will send to someone but once you have this extension installed all you have to do is just tap the aa button and tap on fire links right there it will automatically shorten the link for you you can see the link right there now what i can do is just share it from here or tap right there if I want to copy it. And again, tapping the share button will of course bring up the share sheet from iOS. Infinite Shortcuts is a new app that will bring shortcuts for the action button for the iPhone 15 Pro models. Now, of course, you can use it with other devices as well, but you will just have to use them from the shortcuts app or of course from one of the widgets on your home screen but it's pretty cool you will have here all kinds of really cool shortcuts that you can get for your iphone you can search the shortcuts here you will have the popular ones right there on the second row then you will have ai ones media pro productivity you will have tools there entertainment anything you can think of you will have them right there now the way this works if you go, let's say, to tools and you want to add one of these tools, I can just tap it there and add this shortcut to my shortcuts app. As easy as that, it will redirect you where you can add the shortcut. And then, of course, you can use it with the action button. Transparent Widgets is up next. This app allows to use widgets to create blank spaces on the home screen of your device. And this is how it works. First of all, you head onto your home screen, tap the edit button and go here to the last page where there are no icons. You tap here to take a screenshot. And once you have taken that screenshot, all you have to do is go back into the app and on the app, tap here and tap here to load the screenshot you just took. Now, once you have done that, all you have to do now is just load the widget from this app. So that we have the widget, let's just load one here. So we have here, of course, the transparent ones like this one right there. And you can see that we have created a blank space on my device. Now, if you want to place it somewhere else, like if I want to place it right here, you can see it doesn't look that good, but we can change its settings here to change its position. So you will have there middle and then we have right here so you just place it on its place and just like that you will have a blank space on your home screen next up we have a couple of wallpaper apps this one is called craft wallpapers and it's pretty cool i really like this app because it has some really nice wallpapers and you can see right here the quality is actually really great. The app is simple to use. You can just browse like this and then you will have here different categories. So you will have nature patterns. You will have arts, animals and all that kind of stuff. Now, once you find a wallpaper that you like, of course, you can go ahead and view it like this. So you will see the colors that are on that wallpaper. You can view the wallpaper and of course, just download it to your device. You will have the original size of the wallpaper or you can just crop it to the size of your iPhone screen. Caliber is the next app for the video. Another wallpaper app with some really high quality wallpapers. And it's pretty cool to use because it has this nice interface. Basically, it has a few different collections of wallpapers that you can just download to your device. You tap on one of them and then you will see, of course, all kinds of different wallpapers from that collections. So here we have 
this collection of course we can just go ahead and tap here tap that button where you can go ahead and unlock the wallpaper by watching an ad if you just don't want to actually pay for the app but again it has some pretty cool wallpapers we go back here we have some really nice selected wallpapers that you can get for your iphone dual cameras is up next now this is a free app that allows you to shoot videos and pictures using both of your cameras at the same time so right here we have the rear camera we have the front facing camera over here and of course we can go ahead and switch between them and we can also switch between video and photo now tapping on the settings right there you can actually change the look of your video and photo you can have the border width right here changed you will have all kinds of different styles here and of course any color you want for the border and it makes the video look different but it's just a free simple app that allows to shoot videos and pictures with both both cameras at the same time arc search is up next now if you search a lot on the internet this is the app for you it makes it really easy for you to search anything you want it's pretty cool you will have here all of your tabs and you can see how cool this is it looks just like the app switcher on ios and we can just tap right there to actually clear everything if we want to and then here we have the search bar anytime you tap there you can just go ahead and quickly start searching from there now if we go here we have other tools like of course we have the search bar again but we can copy the link share it or find anything we want on that page directly from here now going to settings you will have here a few different settings you can block ads here block cookie banners and all that stuff and you also have here a default search engine so it uses google but of course you can change it to others like Bing or DuckDuckGo directly from here. And again, an, a very intuitive app. It allows to search for anything at your fingertips just like this, anything you wanna search directly on your keyboard. Video Jointer is up next. Now this is a free video editor for your iPhone and it has most of the tools that you will find on apps that are actually pretty expensive. So you load the videos right here. You can of course add different clips. You will have the timeline right Right there at the top which is pretty cool then you will have all the tools you need right here from trimming to changing the speed of your video and of course you can split the video add text add music maybe or add stickers you can even add different images to this video and you can of course add here other things like picture in picture if you have another video that you want to add to it you can do it from here and as you can see, as simple as that, I can add another video here, which is really, really cool and create a picture in picture effect with this free app, which is really amazing. You can see, you can change, edit the colors. You will have different modes, different alignments, different timing. And of course you can reverse the video, capture anything you want on the video, all the tools you can think of that you can find on a high end video editor you can find on this free app. And last but not least is A to Z converter this allows you to convert pretty much anything you can think of from length to area weight speed time zones age time digital storage anything you want you can just basically convert any unit you can think of so let's just try this out so if we just type right there we can just go ahead and now of course just convert to anything we want. Just add any number you need to convert and you can do that as easy as that, even colors here and anything else you want. So the app, as you can see, is pretty simple. You just have everything here and you have a search bar. Well, of course, you can search for any unit you need. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to smash the like button. Of course, don't forget to subscribe for more. If you need to download any of these apps, all the links will be down below in the pinned comment. Again, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.